So well, the YouTube on that Cornell's Auto Salvage just locked in the gate. This is in Cocoa, Florida. This is in my my uh, my hometown. I didn't grow up here, so I was kind of hesitant saying hometown. <laughs> but I guess it's all my home there, so. Well, they got rid of a lot of the canthers, the RZs, they had a few out here. So, uh, no parts. Unless they sell it at whole. Mustang, little drag car. They were selling the awnings on these for $50. I was going to buy one and put it in front of my garage. <laughs> They had a really nice, brand new one. That one's ripped. There's a little awning. That one looks pretty nice. Too bad it's small, though. It's dent. It's dent like an uh, Airstream one is dent. Probably come down here and grab the refrigerator out of one of these and have the protein refrigerator. Good for us down here where we lose our power a lot. Could have a little backup protein refrigerator. A lot, couple of nice fans, some floral seats for your truck. It's a convertible Trans Am. With NASCAR stickers on it. I wonder if it was a taste car of some sort. <laughs> Kazam! Any chrome dumpers back there? There's Big Dre on here with Big Dre. They got imports on that side. I usually don't want it on that in the import section. Trying my best not to. This is the GM section. Oh, I see an old school blazer down there. We'll go look at it and then I'll cut through. Dre's had no to pull some heater hose off of the LS Lincoln. Uh, he's also here picking up a couple of windows, uh, side windows. Some of must uh, had a fight with a girlfriend or something like that because they were replacing a couple of windows in their car and you seen the thought Jerry had to do all that. I gotta take a picture of this blazer. This thing's awesome. I gotta take a picture of this from my buddy Buck Charles who's just starring a C10. I don't know if he's been down here. Huh. I'm not sure of that grill pattern. 85, maybe? Let's see how I can, uh, I'm looking at the bump of this. See, you got trees all right here. Oh, it says 80 right on the side. I thought it was newer. A little rusty, huh? Not bad, though. The surface rust. So that's an 80 grill. You'd look that old, but pretty good. That would probably be a good item to sell on eBay. And that grill looks really nice. People like that stuff on eBay. Got the jack and everything in here. This was sitting somewhere for a while. Look at this door. Who did that? Got some lift locks. Look at that radiator. Ain't no joke, is it? Nice brass radiator. Oh, that thing's awesome. Damn, that thing is awesome. Oh, I like that thing. Right. Something you just die to hold on to, huh? 
The dash pad wasn't even cracked, but they twisted it all up. There's the grill pieces. Wow, those are probably worth a couple of bucks. This looks like it just sat somewhere for a while and got rotted up. But you that back bump was pretty nice. Alright, let's go see what what else we can find. Someone took the axles out of it. Must have had some nice 14s or something under it. 14 bolts. Some quartz red axles. See some activity then moving around. Just gonna try to oh call that. That's a rare find in this yard. Oh look at that old like 70s uh C10. Look at the core of that. Oh, they got a thunder on it. That's an E-date item right there. This little thunder. Delco shocks. Got some Corvette mirrors. I see a headlight bucket in there. Look at this wide height. Got, here's another headlight bucket right there. I don't know if you can see it with the glare. The 85 called that. We got the matching sharks all the way around. Yeah, those ones are a little rusty though. I heard, I was going to say, I heard the NASA selling there's a lot of money on these early Corvettes. I knew a guy that had one. That's not, it's Snell's over here. There's a couple of, there's a couple of, uh, Chiller Nova Homes right here. On a piece of private property, it's not like a Chiller Park. And, uh, you can smell their waste. That was pretty nice right here, huh? Need the cab corners. What? Right, that might be a fine right there. Pulling this out of here. You got some rotted doors, rotted rockets. Maybe not. There's a lot of work going on. light panels get some lights out there lenses what is that that's an old school steering wheel right there and it looks to be in good condition I'll take a picture of that send it to my brother he's got a 70 Nova he's rebuilding Door closes good, there's a frame, and we're stuck. <laughs> we gotta move through here. Dre's gonna be coming up before we get in. Z28. Uh, the engine's still in there. El Camino, I think this is the El Camino that's been here. Actually, this might be a different one. Let's see what these doors look like. Oh, no, I can't even open it. Rotted. Got that El Camino sitting in my yard. And I got that Malibu. Another nice radiator. That one is not as bossy as the other one. <coughs> Switch hands again so you're not as shaky as my last video. is very shaky. And I know I make shaky videos. I gotta get some better equipment. I gotta take my YouTube channel a little more serious. And I gotta figure out uh, editing. So... <coughs> 
editing software. I know. Uh, I tried to download one a little more than a week ago. It was a. Uh, I can't even remember the name of it. I went on YouTube and I looked up editing software. Uh, and uh, found one that said like the five best editing video softwares. And uh, I picked one of those and tried to download it, but it didn't download. They still got this Lanans over here. Lanans Tentus, looking like a GTL Tudor. I didn't remember it was a Tudor. <laughs> Sixty-six. See you chin tag guys, I don't know if you can read that. That's pretty hard to read. <laughs> I had a Nova this color. Uh, uh 65 Nova. That color. Chevy 2 Nova. <laughs> Two door. I put a LT1. 70 called that engine in it. It used to be a straight six. <laughs> had a car induction hood. I put the big box strings in it. Actually, I put the small box strings in it, the V8 strings. And I had ordered load announce, the train announce on Classic Industries. I had a car induction hood on it. A lot of stuff I bought used from one guy. <coughs> Excuse me. When I bought the car. <coughs> a lot of these are done here, so. I want to keep shooting the same cars older and older for years. This, this yard doesn't have a good turnaround. <coughs> They have a, another yard beside this one. <coughs> Damn. This thing in my throat makes me choke a lot. Look, child, you gonna put that on your truck? That's a short dead, ain't it? No, it's a long dead. <laughs> What's a long bed? That gas kit. Gas kit paint holes a little closer. But. Right. <coughs> 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 yeah, I choked the devil over here. I seen a uh, third generation Canaro over there. Oh, that, uh, that waste I got going next door is very stinky. It's like walking past rock crap. That is gross. And I don't think it'll be long before <coughs> somebody's out here to complain about that. It's not summertime yet, but the town's going to be over there shortly because that stinks hardcore. That's what I took my parents off of. <laughs> that are on my F-350. Oh, I just dropped my rag in the sand. It's all sandy now. I had one of these. It had a Sherry 350 in it. We couldn't get it running. And, uh, which was a shame because Sherry 350 was pretty easy. gave up on it and sold it for what I had into it just to get rid of the big thing and I had took it had a, uh, 
it had a dead on it and I took the dead off of it. It had a uh, flat dead, rack body like. And I took it off, put in the dodge section. Kind of whipped these uh, sands out of my rag. I just came, I was getting hard to walk over here, so we're gonna get out of here. That's where they put all their cars that they crush and they send it. Send to the scrap. They already get the big crusher comes in, they hard flatten it all out. That's a couple acres going back of those cars. You're not allowed to go back there. I have in the past. <laughs> couple more are these. Some Fords. Nothing good. Couple of Lincolns. Oh, sorry guys, changing hands. I slept on the shoulder last night. And that thing hurts bad today. <laughs> That's a five speed. Got a dead. Can you hear that in the camera? Obviously, I can't. Look at that one, 90, a red letter. They said that the turnaround's not that good here. They don't. They get that other yard that they pull the parts off of, and they don't stick that many cars over here. Red molding. Oh, my battery's dying. Well, that's not videoing anymore. I don't think. Oh yeah, still video. This was a clean truck. V8 rotted. That's typical. Can't tell. Five on all series. Trey, I suspect Trey is out of here. These these cars are done here. They probably want to do much money on these nothing parts and that's why they're sitting there. They gotta they gotta um price list that you can look up online and an inventory and the guy just told me they're gonna do they're gonna do a couple of specials coming up and they're gonna do uh, um all you can carry Those are those uh, 85, 86. Oh no, 84s had those too, right? Uh, Mustang seats. Alright, I'm gonna have to start heading out of here. Nothing new, nothing new in this section that I see. I was hoping to see some, uh, some Mustangs. Fox bodies, that fox body's done here. I was looking to see some 